this gun that was used to kill the kids in Newtown has been used to commit a crime in Columbus. And it carries a 30-round magazine. And this was developed to kill people. The mayor today renewed his support for a ban on assault weapons and a ban on higher capacity ammunition magazines. High capacity magazines allow people that are intent on killing to keep killing until they run out of bullets. This gives killers the opportunity to kill as many people as they want 75 to. 75 rounds. 75. And that's again something that was taken off the streets Street. of Columbus. And the mayor is passionate in his belief that requiring background checks for all gun sales would help keep at least some guns out of the hands of criminals. The debate over gun violence has prompted record sales of guns and ammunition. And in the wake of the Sandy Hook school shooting, the National Rifle Association has suggested the answer is to arm more people, including armed guards in schools. Coleman says the powerful NRA lobby is out of touch. Their response has been, let's put guns in the schools. Let's have more guns in the schools. That's crazy. That's tone deaf. That is not being, that's not aligned with, I think, the most of the public is. Certainly not the public in the city of Columbus. In 2012, Columbus police confiscated more than 2,600 guns, including more than 125 assault-style weapons. These guns are being pointed at our residents, and they're being pointed at our police officers as well. It's got to stop. And now's the time for it to stop. Ted Hart, NBC4.